Du, 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 du. Maka, how are you doing? Good to see you again. Uh, hang on, let me turn that down. Uh, let me know if that music's too loud. How have you been, Maka? I'm still getting used to this live streaming with the, the delays and whatnot. I don't know if I should just talk incessantly or not. That's good to hear. Is it Saturday where you are yet? Or not quite? that music's still a bit loud. So what have you been up to? And sorry this might be a bit boring but I figured uh, oh you're in Australia as well. Are you gonna watch the grand final today? Oh and also who are you barracking for? Don't know if I should ask that question if you are gonna watch it. Oh, really? <laughs> you're an NRL fan. I was talking about the real football, not not this. Uh... Yeah, let's not call it football. It's rugby league. Fuzzy rules only goes by one name. So who's actually? I haven't been following the NRL. So who's playing Roosters and? <laughs> Uh, well, well, agree to disagree, although I did spend, what was it, about 10 years in Queensland, so um, before before I actually went to Queensland, uh, this is back in the Roosters and Storm, oh, it's Storm, okay, so I'm from Victoria, but I actually barrack for the Brisbane Broncos, because they started showing rugby league years and years ago in Victoria really late at night and there was no storm at that time so it was back in the days of Alfie Langer and Wendell Saylor and so on so unfortunately that's my team uh, well good luck to the Roosters although sorry to say I'll probably barrack for storm but I take it you're not going to watch the AFL is it? Oh, the other thing is, are they actually, are they playing today or is it tomorrow? No, nope, don't get rules of AFL. <laughs> uh, it can be very confusing uh, when you first start. But having said that, Stink Pants, uh, oh yeah, NRL's tomorrow. I'll watch that as well. Uh, I'll have a soft spot there for the Roosters for you, but I guess I'm going to have to be semi-loyal to Storm being Victorian. Uh, just hang on a sec while I concentrate. Hopefully we won't be sitting for too long in the clouds today, but we'll see how it goes. What am I doing? What have I got? Ooh, I'm going to change that. Sorry, I find it a little bit hard to, to uh, chat and play at the same time. I'm not much of a multitasker. Starters. Go take out that town hall. Do it, do it, take it out. Take it out, yes. All right, looking good so far. Just got to keep an eye on these heroes. So how's your uh, gameplay been going? Uh, what town hall are you now? And are you doing the clan games as well? You get your 4,000 points or whatever it is at the moment. This one's going slow. You reckon I can 100%? Probably not. 
Almost finished, just waiting for that king to do its thing. I quit, but it's iCloud, so Town Hall 10. Oh, why'd you quit? You get tired of the game. Didn't want to play it anymore? It's sort of understandable. I'd get a bit sick of it myself after a while, so sorry for the, the lack of uploads as well. We've been a, a little bit busy between the two of us, and... Um, not playing as much as you normally do. But given you're a Town Hall 10, you're, you're not far off uh, being at the, the top level. All right, he's just about to die there. Come on. Last little bit. So if anyone's wondering why I don't use the clan troops, I figure there's sort of no point wasting the, the clan's resources if we don't need to. And not even sure why I'm actually, uh, oh, you were rushed, sort of. Well, you can always get out of being rushed, I guess. Uh, oh, not enough space. Sorry, again, I tend to go quiet just while I concentrate. <laughs> Almost there. And that's good. So, yeah, I, I'm not too sure <laughs> what the point of this is. Um, with the, the Clash of Clans game, they've done it again where uh, I can't actually upgrade any walls, if you see that in a moment. So I end up sitting on a ton of resources. My mum and brother are fighting about... Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Uh, how old's your brother? And why... I t you, you don't have to answer any of this because I guess it's kind of personal, but if you want to reply, why are they fighting? I'm guessing that uh, your mother doesn't like the, the girlfriend that much. All right, so... We'll do a boost here just to get things, oh, not that one, that one, just to get things rolling. And from memory, yep, we got a free one. He wants to watch The Nun. Is The Nun a movie or is it an actual nun? Because if it's a movie, what's the, the big deal? Well, maybe she, no, oh, it's a movie. Uh, does she not trust them going to the movies together? She wants them to have a, um, what are they called? A, uh, what is the word? Chaperone. Is she wanting a chaperone or something like that? And I suppose it's a good thing, at least she's concerned. And uh, probably best you stay out of that argument. <laughs> there's, there's no point getting involved with things that uh, demon is it? Oh, okay, yeah. It might. Is it a new movie? I guess it would be, wouldn't it? In space, if you have a possessed nun and she's even semi-religious, she's not going to like it. So, uh, is he more into? Spending time with a girlfriend or watching the actual movie? Because if he just wants to spend time with a girlfriend, pick another movie. Don't know. Uh, yeah, uh, it's probably. Is he the older or younger brother to you? you? Might be able to give him some brotherly advice if you're older. If you're younger, he's probably not going to take it. Oh, the king's still going. He doesn't get to go anywhere for, his, for a fortnight. <laughs> Has he been grounded? He did something wrong previously, or...? Uh, I remember the days when I was grounded for being naughty. It wasn't much fun. You really couldn't do too too much. I need to 
depends what kind of restrictions I guess you have with the grounding as well. So if he has been naughty macker, don't, don't follow his example. You show him what a, a good person does as opposed to a naughty person. Oh no, 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 that's not good. Yeah, she uh, probably would be very upset with that. Um, most parents, yeah, well I shouldn't, yeah, I'm still going to say most parents, uh, they're not going to like this wearing too much. It's pretty disrespectful. So even uh, these days, ah, oh, hi Kane, how are you? Long time no speak. How have you been? Uh, and while you're answering that, yeah, uh, I know my father used to really not like it when we would swear we'd get punished just for that. So, say, even if you're the younger brother, just say to him, uh, you know, you're a little bit wrong in the wrong there. Oh, that's good to hear, Kane. Um, is it the weekend where you are yet or still Friday? And if it is the weekend, what do you got planned? It's Friday. So you in the States, is it? I guess it'd still be Friday in the States. If I say anything... To... Oh no! What's with your brother, Macca? You tell him, stop being so violent, stop swearing. You're going to get nowhere with any of that. Oh, well, that's good, Kane. It's always good to have a lazy day. I think I'm planning to as well. Uh, Macca there and I are both from the same country and we've got uh, grand finals going on at the moment. So it's a bit of an exciting weekend for us in our country, although uh, we follow different codes. So he's probably not as excited as I am today. Being watching the footy later on. Uh, we call it gridiron for you, your, your football. It's uh, gridiron for us. So hopefully your lazy day will be uh, entertaining regardless. All right, so I do have a boost on, so you will see some raid soon. Sorry if um, we're in the clouds, but yeah, yes. Uh, hopefully you can tell from the accent uh, but yes, I'm Australian, so um, I hope that's okay. You can actually understand what I'm saying. Uh, same, I'm only going to a redhead count to break a world record, hopefully. Oh, I don't know what you mean, Macca. What's a redhead count? And good luck with breaking a world record. That'd be awesome if you do that. But I'm curious now what a... Yeah, what a redhead count is. Is that the number of redheads that you see down the street? Something like that. And, uh, oh, you're bored. Well, I'll try and entertain you as much as I can. Kane, I'm still learning how to do the, uh, the live streams. Because, uh, number one, the, because of the delay, like, I don't want to just sort of keep talking rubbish because you might end up getting bored with me doing that. But uh, unless you guys are constantly typing, I sort of don't really know what I should be talking about. But happy to discuss most things, as long as it's not too personal. Uh, yeah. So... How are you going with the game as well, Kane? Um, Maku is saying you're sort of not playing it much anymore, but you still playing? And if so, how's that going? What do we got? Eight minutes, seven minutes. These clan games and uh, having to attack on the builder base is not something I particularly enjoy, but it has to be done. Does that mean you can spam? Yeah, you can spam if you want, and I don't... Oh, for brain cancer. Yeah, that's fine. Anything for a good cause is good. Um, 
Good working on bass. That's good. Uh, what level is your bass now, Kane? And uh, for Maka, when you... I'm going to Redhead Count to break a world record. Oh, Town Hall 8. Nice. Uh, that's good. I remember the days of Town Hall 8. It was a lot of fun. Do you have special troop lineups or anything like that? That's, I think that's what it was for last time. So explain to me the redhead count, because I've never never heard that. Not that I'm really up to date with, um, I don't know, like I donate to certain charities like the RSPCA um, every month. So when it comes to other charities, I sort of don't follow them that closely. But very curious. I'd be happy to make a donation if someone knocks on the door. I'm guessing you're probably in too far of a state for me to for you to knock on my door anyway. Um, yeah, so what else? I suppose I'm about to do another raid. Uh, if you want any tips while I'm here or you've got any questions, uh, just ask away. I'm happy to help. I figure we'll still do the, the tutorials that we have been doing. Um, sorry, I've been a little bit slack. We've both been a bit busy. Um, but I figured the live streams are actually good as well to try and assist. And, you know, if you're doing anything on YouTube as well, not that I'm an expert, but so I get a lot of questions about that as well. It's in Orange. We go to a footy place. People set up a theme park kind of thing. Then they count us. Oh, nice. So do you actually live in Orange? You're a, a country boy of sorts. Uh, if that is the case, I also grew up in the country, so something about the uh, country folk, don't mind them at all. Uh, oh, okay, we're up for another raid. Yeah, these raids are going to be a little bit pointless in the sense that uh, I'm full of loot at the moment. I can't actually spend it. Nice, I've been through Orange before. It's a nice town. So, Kane, the it depends what your um, priorities are. So when I was a Town Hall 8, and even today, and you'll see from the attacks that I do, um, rightly or... Yeah, but that's good. It's good if you can attack lower bases. Uh, it should, should make it a bit easier for you. So... Um, with me, and I'm not saying this is the, the best way to go, but I've always been a percentage player. So uh, with the farming and things, I never really understood it. I don't do it myself. Uh, I always go for the win, but that's what I mean by a percentage player. So as a Town Hall 8, I can still remember, um, I just got very, very good at using Barch attacks, so barbarians and archers, uh, maybe half a dozen giants or something if you want to do a better attack. And what you try and do is get really good at that style of attacking. Uh, there's a few different ways to do it. I'd love to do a tutorial on it and I might do that one day even though it's very difficult to do for a Town Hall 12 level, the, the Barch attack's kind of hard with the, the um, Eagle Artillery. But anyway, um, there's basically two or three different ways you can do it. But the most important thing that you've got to learn how to do is to work out the range of the archers. And because you don't have the, the cloud time that you can see that I've got now, you can just keep skipping bases until you find the ones that you think have a, a good chance or a very good chance of getting 50% with the outside buildings. So when I talk about the range of, arc, uh, range of the archers, if you drop an archer on an outside building and you can see that it's not being attacked, uh, will drags, yeah, dragons are very good for Town Hall 8 as well use them in combination with uh, rage spells uh, that's also very good for your war attacks uh, you've got a high percentage chance of getting a hundred percent with that uh, it is expensive to train but um oh, okay maka well hopefully we will see you again 
soon. Uh, have a good one today, and if you can be bothered watching the AFL, go for it. And even though I'm Victorian, uh, go West Coast Eagles. No one likes Collingwood, except for Collingwood fans. Uh, so, yeah, with the, the Dragons, they're really good. Now, we are going to post a video on a, a Dragon attack soon. We've already got the material for that. I've just got to uh, edit the video, basically, and have Stink Pants available so that she can do some commentary as well. She's actually better at Dragon attacks than me as well. So uh, they're, they're actually perfect for Town Hall 8, they can work for Town Hall 9 as well. Anything above that's probably a bit hard, or anything below that is good. So if you don't mind spending the loot uh, for the Dragons, then that's better than using the Barch. Uh, I personally never used an all-drag attack. I probably should have, uh, but it was just because I was cheap. So I was always looking for whatever the cheapest combination was to, to be able to get resources more easily and more quickly. Yeah, yeah, this is what people don't realise. Uh, when you see in the global chat, if someone is complaining about the clouds like I'll do right now. Uh, oh, there we go, finally. All right, so sorry, I'm just concentrating again. So just so that you guys are aware, what I'm looking for, and you would have seen it in a previous video, is where those... Uh, air sweepers are because they're the most annoying thing uh, when it comes to an air raid so just as long as you stay away from those which is what I'm about to do now all right so again sorry if I go a little bit quiet just while I'm concentrating it also doesn't really help I'm down a hero at the moment but hopefully that'll be okay Jeez, my troops have already been kind of decimated, which is not good. No, get that eagle artillery. Kill it. That's the one thing you want to try and destroy at this. Ah, oh, didn't do it. Come on. Nah. All right, I might be in a bit of trouble here. We'll see how it goes. Where's the queen over there? Where's the king over there? Still going strong at the moment, but hopefully... Oh, I'm gonna do the clean special power. King's still going strong. Oh, I might have to use clan troops in this one. Sorry to my clan if that's the case. Oh no, should be able to get away with it just. Almost there. Yeah, well that's what I mean by uh, percentage player um, Kane. I'm not, not really looking to three star on the raids. Yeah, Eagle Artillery is very bad. It's bad for the um, the heroes especially. So you do want to try and take it out if you can. But as you can see, that was just like a percentage play. So uh, as long as I get the win, you can sort of see how much uh, bonus loot I get. So that's the main reason for doing it. Okay, so that's that one. Training everything again. Good to go. And sorry, you're just basically getting a tutorial. Uh, yeah. uh, no, didn't get a three star. But so long as so long as I got the win, that's mainly what I'm looking for. And if you have a look on the the right hand side there with the loot that I've got, um, that really doesn't matter at this point. It's not like I'm getting anything out of it. Is all the builders are busy I think what is it that one there's the 12 hours away is probably the next one that I can use and then that one at 18 hours so for the moment I can't really do too much I've got enough time to do yeah I do I'll do a builder raid don't like the builder base that much but we'll see how it goes with that one so this one's just more for the clan games at the moment and um, to be honest, I'm pretty lazy when it comes to the the builder base. It's not something... Did you clan max clan games? Not yet. I think um, I'll check after this attack so you can see how we're going. Uh, we pretty much always do, though. I think we've only missed the 
the clan games once uh, a long time ago. Um, but that was when they needed, I think it was 75,000 points or something like that. It was a ridiculous amount of points. So, but yeah, we usually, usually finish it with a lot to spare. So the guys uh, are pretty much vested in it. You know, there's a uh, good to get the, the bonuses with that. So it's one thing that's actually helped you get a bit further in the game. You tend to be able to get things happening more quickly. Uh, I might not have won that. We'll see how it goes. Two stars is better than one, I guess. Lucky nuts. Bowlers, I don't have. Oh, fine. No, I can't do it for you at the moment, mate. Can I give you a. Yeah, I can give you one of those, though. Alright, sorry, you're gonna have to wait. Lucky nuts if you're even watching the stream, which I doubt. And, uh, so, how are we doing on the clan games? It's almost halfway at the moment. And it's only been around for a day. <laughs> well, Kane, uh, nothing wrong with that. At least you're contributing. Uh, hi, SP. How are you? Uh, nice to meet you. I don't think I've said hello to you before. Uh, how have you been? So, nothing wrong with it, uh, Kane. At least you're contributing, but it's always better to get more if you can. But I suppose if your clan is like ours and it consistently... Uh, maxes it then it's not that important so if you look on our list you'll have quite a few guys I mean it's only been going for a day but we'll probably get the aim I think and I've never really said it to the clan but the aim I reckon is if if it's 50,000 points and you get the top 10 get their 4,000 points then you're going to end up um having 40,000 points from 10 players and then the rest don't matter so much. They're also a little bit slow to getting started, but they usually do. So we've already got four tiers uh, rewards there already. Uh, but leader told me that I can stop. Info. Oh, well, that's fair enough if your leader's all right uh, with it. I mean, we don't... Um, I'm not going to say I'm a, a good leader or anything like that, but... I don't put any pressure on the guys. We don't even really talk about the clan games, uh, except for the fact that some people will say it takes too long to get the rewards. I've seen them say that before. Geez, there's a few people that aren't in leagues yet. We'll have to see what happens there later on. And yeah, we're ready for another raid already. Hopefully we won't be in the clouds for too long. We'll see how this one goes. So with the, the clan games, if it helps, Kane, uh, again, it's different for everyone. But as you can see, and you've already commented about how long I spend in the clouds, uh, for me, I tend to go after the builder base um, points just because it's much, much easier for me to do. So you basically want to pick the ones that you know that you can complete in time. And if you know you're going to be playing the game for an hour or so, go for the builder base ones because then it's easier to get the, the points on those. They don't take very long, unlike what you can see I'm doing with the, the cloud searching. Sometimes I find it very difficult to complete uh, the games just because of how long it takes. If, if everyone's... Uh, no, sorry, if all of the points that are being suggested are not builder base then I'm going to struggle uh, you got one good clan I wish you well you can you can uh, join Kane we don't have a problem with it um, the the only problem is as you can see we're we're often full so they're they're pretty loyal and we tend to just boot people every now and again and you're only going to get booted if you don't do something uh, we only have three or four simple rules. So, you know, you have to donate and be good at donating. You keep the, the ratio balanced. Uh, if you're going to be in the, the clan wars, make sure you fight twice. Yeah, we don't mind if you don't do war, just so long as you opt out. That's the big one that will get you booted most of the time from our clan. 
if you've selected that you want to be in the war and then you don't fight twice, well, that gets annoying for everyone else that's, you know, spending all their resources and trying to win and then someone doesn't attack. That's the most common reason uh, for people being booted from the clan. So I think someone was booted just after the last war because of that. Um, and then the, the only other rule we have really is just being respectful. Um, there's no, because we've got kids in the clan as well as well as adults, we don't have the swearing or people being abusive to each other. It's just sort of not tolerated. And once you follow those rules, that's it. There, there's really nothing else. Um, so we're happy to accept you. If you bookmark the clan, I guess you can keep an eye on whether or not we've got a space available. Uh, just having a look at the list there, um, what I do or try to do is give them till the end of the games and then if they haven't really done anything, uh, for me it's, it's four things. Like if they're not in a league, they haven't donated troops, they're not opting in for war and they haven't done clan games, well there's no point them really being there. So I might boot, uh, just to give you a time frame, uh, I might be booting some people at the end of the clan games. So, you know, in five days time, check on the clan, you might have a space available to you. So, uh, yeah, you can be. And uh, even for anyone else that's uh, watching this as well, if you do want to be a part of the, the YouTube channel, a couple of people that aren't in the clan have already been given uh, some mentions on a couple of videos from their suggestions. So, uh, like if they said, oh, we want a tutorial on X, Y, Z, and we do the tutorial, we ask them if it's okay to just give them recognition for that because it was their idea. And so far, everyone's been happy with that. So you end up being part of the channel that way. Um, and then of course, yeah, if you, you're in the clan, um, and you'd like some of your attacks posted or something like that, we can do that as well. We've already done that with a few players in the clan. Then the last one, uh, I'm not even sure if he's watching at the moment, but I met a, a guy from the States that's been extremely helpful um, teaching me how to do streaming and uh, how to do um uh, a few other things with the game he's not in our clan but because i've actually spoken to him um what do you call it not in person but like over discord uh there was one video that we uploaded where i got stink pants to leave our clan and join his clan to get some replays and he joined our clan to give us some replays so even though he wasn't, he's not in our clan, his attacks were still shown, and we did it that way. It takes a little bit more planning and a little bit more effort, but we're happy to do that as well, because the reality is I think it might, um, I don't know if it is boring for people to, to watch what we do, but the problem that we have is she's, a t she's actually a Town Hall 11 now. She's just recently upgraded and I'm a Town Hall 12. Hi, handsome dude, how are you? Uh, I don't think I've met you before. Uh, how are you? What are you up to today? So going back to that, um, a lot of our attacks, they're just going to be Town Halls 10, 11 and 12 because that's all we can get access to. It's very rare for me to see anything below a Town Hall 11. Uh, hi, Manju Sharma. I uh, think you're another new person I've never spoken to before. How are you as well? I'm not getting the responses on the how are yous, but we'll see how it goes. So if we have uh, lower people, like I've got a couple of uh, in social studies, so I picked Australia because I think it's true. <laughs> uh, well, thank you very much for that, uh, Kane. I, I guess when it's you're from that country, you don't like it as much. I'm not a big fan of the Australian accent, but uh, and we do have a couple of different types of accents, I guess, if you listen closely. I've got a bit more of a country accent. So if you want any tips or advice on your social studies, let me know, Kane. I'll try and help you with that as well. Now, handsome dude, in our clan, our leader never came online, so our clanmates uh, just... 
decided, I think you're trying to say there, to, to give leadership to me. Uh, oh, so Ansem, the only way that you can actually get leadership in that plan is if the current leader gives it to you. So I've done that a few times. I've given up the leadership, I think maybe seven or eight times by now. And hi, Inferno. Um, I think I have spoken to you before. How are you today? Uh, so going back to handsome dude. Um, uh, welcome back, Kane. And by the way, if you read the, the comments, Kane, uh, our friend... <coughs> Excuse me, I'm coughing. Uh, where was I? Oh, yeah, the, the leadership. So... The, the only way you can get it is if the current leader gives it up to you. So if anyone knows him or her personally and can send... Uh, oh, congratulations, Inferno. That'll be great. You'll have a lot to upgrade after that. Uh, good luck with that. Uh, you might want to say Town Hall 9. It's been a while since I was that as well. Uh, don't forget to upgrade the, the troops that you're using the most first and your defences as well. So sorry, back to Handsome. Uh, if anyone does know the leader and can send a message to them on, I don't know, Discord or WhatsApp or Messenger, anything like that, and just sort of ask him politely, look, we, we like the clan, we want to stay here, but you're just not active enough. Would you be okay with giving me the, the leadership? Uh, hopefully he'll do it. Um, my personal view, just because I have been, um, like this this clan is the one that I started and it was the very first clan that I was in, it means that I've put in years, uh, however long Clan Wars has been on, that's how long the clan's been around. Oh, nice. I appreciate uh, that, Kane. Uh, he's free to say hi as well. Yeah, no problem, uh, handsome. Just be aware, um, if you want a couple of tips with that, and I'll get to you in a moment, Inferno, but a couple of tips with that, handsome, is just set up a couple of simple rules for the clan to follow. Now, I'm repeating myself because I actually already mentioned them earlier in the stream, but... We basically have three or four simple rules and most clans have them anyway, but you know, make sure people donate and keep a good donation ratio. Uh, make sure if they do fight in war that they fight twice. Texas, hey, how are you going? Long time no speak. Uh, sorry guys, hang on, I've just got to concentrate again. Now, find those air sweepers for me. Where are those air sweepers? There's, there they are. Which way are they facing? That's not good. All right. So what I'm trying to do here is avoid the air sweeper on the left and hopefully destroy the air sweeper on the right. But we'll see how it goes because those air sweepers are very painful. All right. So just bear with me while I'm doing this. And take out that eagle artillery, you guys. Take it out. This is the most important thing. Do it. Take it out. Come on. Take out that town hall. Do it. You're not going to do it for me. Almost there. No, didn't get it. All right. So just basically following the heroes at this point. Almost done. And sorry, I'll get to your comments in a moment, but I probably shouldn't be looking at the screen while I'm doing this. Oh, geez, I didn't even see that. I'm so used to having the the sound on the game turned on so I can hear when those clan troops come out. So it's a bit weird to have everything turned off, but from the first stream I learnt that's probably the best way to go. All right, that's everything, that's everything. Toh. Jeez, and that loot is wasted. <laughs> so this is for your entertainment, guys. Look, I can't even collect stuff at the moment. All right. Oh, not that one. What am I doing? So 
Uh, the other thing I'll say is, sorry you're seeing the same kind of troops as well, but this is what I mean about percentage play. It's just an easy way for me to get the wins, which is all we're really doing at the moment. And look, you can see how long I was in the clouds. Everything's ready to go again. Just make sure, yeah, everything's ready to go again. Here we go again. All right. Uh, oh, geez, there's been quite a few chats. Hang on, I'm falling back here. Uh, later, I'm back. Town Hall 9, I've already said congratulations. Uh, no problem, handsome. I said that already. Uh, Inferno, I've been playing the game one year after it came out, so I've played for five years, but it took lots of breaks. Oh, you've been playing pretty much as long as me, Inferno. Uh, I've also, I started, I think, within about six months of the game starting. Uh, I've said hello to Texas. You haven't told me how you've been or what you're up to. Uh, Cole the best. Hi. Um... I'm not sure what you mean by corners, so if you want to explain that, uh, let me know. Now, Texas, Deer Hunter, is that based on the movie? Because if it is, uh, I'd be very interested in that. Uh, if it's the game that I saw years ago where you're basically shooting deers, a uh, bit of fun, probably wouldn't do it in real life, but don't mind, sh in fact, I love shoot 'em up games. <laughs> Thanks, Kane. Yeah, I sort of got it. Didn't get the three star, but as you know, I'm not not uh, that keen on it. Now, hi, Michael Anthony Asquith. How are you? Uh, fire away with your question. I'm happy to answer that when you're ready. Uh, Cole is the best. Do you add people as if... No. So, uh, generally speaking, and I'm not trying to be... Um, cocky or, or whatever but the reality is I get friend requests all the time from strangers and I don't really know why they do it so when it comes to that uh, I tend to keep the people that are in real life so I've only got one or two that I've added as friends because I actually know who they are what I thought was a better way and this was one of the reasons why the YouTube channel was started was uh, you can stay in contact with us this way. Um, yeah, yeah, I'd say you're probably right with that. And thanks also for saying nice clan. We sort of worked hard on it for a number of years to get, get it where it is at the moment. Uh, so, yeah, they do tend to... I'm not sure what they want out of it, though, because if you can't get into the, the clan easily, I can't really help you. Uh, unless it's through YouTube. So again, this is why we sort of did this to try and uh, help people that aren't in the clan. So uh, yeah, I always get people asking me to delete the, the requests that I've already got so that they can send one. But um, sorry to disappoint anyone that wants it. But yeah, I, I tend not to, to accept friend requests. Um, yeah, might change one day, but it's probably safer to, to not do it. And I'm still waiting on your question, Michael Anthony Acequith. Um, no, well, don't leave then, Kane. I'm happy for you to be here. Uh, do you like have... Do you like only have one account or more? Um, yes. At the moment, I only have one account. Now, I'll let you... And I'll, I'll give you some help with the crystal in Town Hall 7 as well. Uh, but before that, so one day I may create a second account just so you can see things from the very start. And it's going to be easier to do tutorials and so on. But I was also thinking if I ever do that, I'd probably just stream it just because things move much, much faster. So I've got a, a tablet that, um, well, they keep saying that in Inferno, but uh, they tend to, clouds are good for a little bit and then they get rubbishy again. Uh, sorry, I keep cutting off my own conversation, but I've got to do this again. Where are those? There's one in the worst place. Where's the other one? Down there. All right, so this one, we've got to go this way, so you'll see I sort of do the same thing with every attack. But this is what I was saying about getting good uh, at an attack, feeling confident 
with what you're doing because it helps a lot if you're confident that you're going to do all right with a certain style of attack. You go for that. No, you're all avoiding it. Go for it. No, you're all going the wrong way. Ah, again, I'm going to have a problem with the Eagle Artillery. We'll see how that goes, but the Queen's gone in the wrong direction. Hopefully, the, no, it's trained on the King. The King can take a lot more abuse from that Eagle Artillery than... Oh, Clown Troops have come out. Uh, than the Queen can. The Queen tends to die very quickly from it. Uh, looks like we'll be alright. Go for it, Dragon. Kill that. It. Did you do it? No, do it now. Get rid of that Eagle Artillery. You do it too, King. Oh, can we get the Town Hall? Maybe not. Go, Queen. Get the Town Hall. Do it. Do it. Is it getting there? It's close. Come on. Do it. Do it. Do it. Yes. All right. So that's a two star for once. And again, just waiting for everything to die at this point. And I'll get to the comments in a second. Just bear with me. I'm still just concentrating. Almost there. And is that everything? It looks like that's everything. Yeah, that's everything. All right. Now, it should get the bonus. So what's that? What are we up to? Three, four hundred thousand. And then on top of that, we get the bonus. And all of that was wasted. <laughs> so I don't know whether it's good to, to max out on things or not, because it does get a little bit boring when you can't do anything with the loot. I'm just waiting for the, the builders to finish their upgrades. Oh, oh yeah, I used that. <laughs> all right, has my boost... Um, oh no, it's still going. Uh, how long have I got? Sorry guys, I will get to your comments in a moment, but uh, because of the clan game... Oh god, I lost that one. Because of the clan games, I do have to try and do this builder base as well. So just bear with me. And yeah, I don't don't really put too much into the, the builder base. I don't really like putting much effort into it. It's a pretty lazy attack, this one. Uh, sorry, just bear with me guys. I will get to your comments in a second. Just doing this first. Almost there. Alright. Nice one. Can we get the two stars? Maybe not. No, looks like I might struggle with that. King's still looking good. And did you take out that big cannon? That's good. Oh yeah, two stars. I very much doubt we're going to get three on this one, but we'll see what happens. What's left? King and one pecker or two peckers? Can't tell. Almost there. And is that everything? No, there's still one going. Uh... All right, so I've got to go back up in the chat there. Uh, get rid of that. Uh, oh, people are requesting. Yes, I can give you one. Bowlers, I don't have time to train for you at the moment. Lucky, but just bear with me. You'll get something sooner or later. All right, so just waiting on the radio. Oh, geez, I've got more bonus. I might have to do another boost. All right, so where are we? Probably because they like the profile. Uh, yeah, I was talking about the one account. So um, I've been sitting on a tablet for a couple of years now, uh, just waiting to set up that second account. So maybe it'll happen soon. Uh, now, for your question, Anthony, I'm in war going up against a town hall with strong... Add or oh, air defense, okay. I'm a town hall aid as well. What should I go the base with? Um, Michael, I always find the the easiest default attack is to use all dragon and rage in war, even if uh, they've got strong defenses. Um, if you've got max dragons and max rage for your level, 
it should town it should uh, 100% just about any town all eight it's like the default attack it's a very very good one to use in war uh, if you did want to change it up to something else you can do that uh, for town hall 8 uh, go wipe might be a good one but I tend to encourage people just do the all dragon one and all you really have to do is get good at um, placing the spells be patient with placing the spells and make sure you put them in front of the, the dragons um, so and where in the direction that you believe they're going to go to uh, that tends to make things a lot easier they can take a lot of abuse even from a, a strong air defense they can take a lot of abuse so that would be what I'd recommend to you uh, if that's not good enough let me know in the chat and I'll see if I can get uh, come up with a different strategy uh, if you look at some of our other videos as well, for example, the funneling one, uh, that might help you because that works with any troops. So you can have a look at some of the tutorials we've put up. Uh, we will be putting up an all dragon one soon. That's actually the next video that we have planned. So if you would stick around and uh, subscribe or something like that, you will uh, be no and hit the notification bell. You'll be notified when that goes up. Uh, so, sorry Kane, I didn't even see your recommendation there as I was doing that. Uh, now Cole, there's Town Hall 7's as Titan Champs Masters Crystals. Oh that's right, you were asking me about uh, how to go. So uh, Cole, I'd mentioned it earlier in the stream as well that if you're looking to trophy push, um, I personally, oh geez, I'm ready to go again, sorry I should have been paying attention to that. So uh, if you're going to trophy push, I'd recommend uh, at your level, because it's only Town Hall 7, uh, get very good at the Barch attack using Barbarians and Archers, maybe some Giants as well, half a dozen or so if you don't mind spending the resources, and get good at percentage wins. And by that I mean aim to 50% when you win. Uh, if, you, if you like after this raid I'll show you my uh, attacks log and you'll see I don't think I've lost one in a, in a while I'll, I'll have a look myself but it's because I've gotten good at the types of attacks that I use and you'll find that um, don't don't put pressure on yourself like I've never personally trophy chased and never tried to go up legs I tend to let the game dictate where I should be so if I'm supposed to be in that league, then the game will put me in that league, you know, and sort of don't actively try and try and get higher or lower or, or whatever. Uh, everyone's different. You don't have to follow that advice, but that's just what I do. Uh, so, yeah, and again for you, Cole, Dragons and Rage are good. Anything Town Hall 8 or below, Dragons and Rage are good. Uh, it, it tends to get you the, the most amount of stars. You can three-star pretty easily, so on. Um, and then if your clan's okay with you using a lot of troops to do it, then go for it. Our clan, I think, over time has started to do what I do. They don't request a lot. They don't use a lot of troops when they're doing raids. And if you've been watching, you see that I don't use them unless I have to. Uh, where are you going to get your Grand Warden? Uh, that's still four or five days away. But, uh, no, I'll check it after this. It's a few days away. And to be honest, I wasn't planning on upgrading any of the heroes, but they're not letting me upgrade any walls at the moment. So I tend to uh, have to upgrade one or two heroes at a time, which makes attacking very difficult. You tend to rely on the, the hero heroes the more uh, higher up you go, just because the bases are quite harder. So um, I'll show you in a moment. So I've got to, I might actually write this down. There's couple of things that I said I was going to do so uh, what was it check attacks and check Grand Warden so I can already upgrade uh, the Grand Warden and one of the other heroes again now I just don't have builders available uh, so Kane question when you have max heroes why do they die easily Okay, so with that one, Kane, there's a couple of 
different ways to look at it. The first one is what defenses are going to do the most damage to heroes. So for it, as an example, uh, the Eagle Artillery, if it latches onto the Queen, it's going to do a lot of damage very quickly and it will kill the Queen very quickly. Uh, the King can take more punishment, but again, if the, the Eagle Artillery locks onto that, sooner or later you're going to lose your King. Uh, when it comes to some of the other things, uh, the mortars do virtually no damage to your heroes. They, the damage, so don't be afraid of mortars and heroes. That's not a problem. Um, the main ones you really want to look out for with the heroes, are, funnily enough, it's the cannons. The cannons do a lot of damage to the, the queen. Uh, obviously, the king can take more damage, but it does do more damage to the king as well. Um, things like, well, air defense isn't going to do anything to either of them. It'll do the Grand Warden, though, if you have that set to air. Uh, and then all of the other, the, actually, the Wizard Tower as well can do a lot of damage if it happens to lock on to anything. So they're the main ones, the Cannon, the Wizard Tower and the Eagle Artillery. They'll kill your heroes pretty quick, but anything else is not too bad. Uh, they use nine drags, six minions, and eight archers for Town Hall 7. So my maths might be a bit out here, but six minions means 12 space, and eight archers means... Oh, okay, so they've used... Instead of using one extra dragon, they're using minions and archers. I guess that kind of uh, makes sense, because you may want some extra troops just to take care of some outside buildings or something like that, or they might move a bit faster. Uh, the reason I didn't suggest that though is I've just seen way too many all dragon attacks in war that three star. Like I've seen so many of them, so many people that uh, attacked us when we had a lot of town hall eights. They, they just all use dragon rage. And Kane, as I was saying, the um, the Grand Warden's upgrading at the moment, so that's why I don't, don't have it. Um, and as soon as it's finished, I'm going to have to upgrade it again just to try and get rid of some of that loot. So, yeah, that's it. And lucky enough to see a stream where I'm not actually down two heroes because that's ugly. I'll still raid, but I don't win that many when it's like that it's very difficult to do it with uh, out the heroes and the the grand warden's actually quite useful uh when you get to it to be able to protect the troops so that's another again i've already uploaded a tutorial on it if you watch the heroes one you'll see what i mean but with the grand warden it can actually do two different things you can set it to ground to protect ground troops or you can set it to um set it to air to take care of air troops so yeah it's a, a handy little thing but just make sure you know which one's which because uh, i've certainly forgotten to change it over before and it's practically useless if you if you don't use it for what it's meant to be used for uh, I've seen a lot of people use the Grand Warden in the same way that they would use their normal troops, which doesn't work. So I'm not sure why they would do that, but they, they might not know how it works yet. So, uh, and hopefully, yeah, uh, Michael, that I answered your question there uh, with your war attack. All right, so if you guys have more questions, please feel free to ask them. I will try my best to answer them uh, while I'm here. Now, the other thing I'll apologize for in advance is, uh, even though I've only done three or four streams, for whatever reason, it tends to cut out after the one hour mark. Um, I tried with the last one to see how long it'd go for. And apologies to anyone that was in that other stream. I couldn't see the chat at all. So people were talking, but I couldn't actually see the text. So I didn't think anyone was saying anything. Uh, so if this stream does cut out suddenly, I do apologize. It's not me doing it. 
Uh, it's either the, the software or the apps that are being used, or maybe YouTube itself just doesn't want you to do particularly long streams, but I'll let it keep going until it at least cuts out. So hopefully it'll be all right. We'll see how it goes. You might get a mega marathon stream if it's looking good. Uh, so that one's basically that. Now, uh, what else have we got? Uh, I take it there aren't that many Australians here. I'm kind of excited about the grand final today and the one Australian that's in the, the chat is not going to watch it. So <laughs> uh, it's a big day for us. Unfortunately, my team only got to the, the preliminary final, so the one before the grand final. Very disappointing. They're on the top of the ladder for the most of the season and didn't end up making it. Very disappointing. So we'll have to wait and see what happens with that one. And for the people that are in the chat, don't be afraid to say hi. I'm not going to bite. Uh, we'll keep it all very friendly. I don't uh, try to keep it family friendly as well. So, yeah. Oh, there are more chats. I didn't see them. Hang on. Uh, just bear with me. Uh, oh, Jesus, quite a few. Sorry, I missed quite a few chats. Just bear with me. So I've already answered that. I uh, thought you didn't know. I've got the Grand Warden. Uh, <laughs> so, Inferno, why have we called it Pete Hot and Stink Pants? You're probably about the 10th person that has asked that. Now, one day we will actually give this story. If, if the channel ever grows big enough, and we become even like a little bit popular, then we're going to answer that question and we might even do a um, animation film clip to go along with that. Um, but that's going to take time because neither of us are animators and Stink Pants's sisters are the ones that help us with that, but they live in another country, so it's, it's pretty hard to organise. Uh, there is a story, there is a reason... Uh, hopefully you've already seen the, the cartoon characters. Um, but yeah, I'm keeping it secret for the moment. Uh, just because it's something that we do want to put a bit of effort into later on in time. Um, but it's not something that we're going to address right now. So we will get to it and thank you for asking as well. Uh, so I guess Kane, you're asking Inferno what he is, not me. Um, yeah, he said he was going to Town Hall 9. Oh, uh, Kane, that's fine. Give you, sorry, I'm not going to respond to this when you're talking to each other. I won't interrupt that. Uh, and game, I don't know my numbers. Push your account. Yeah, I don't know how to do any of that either, by the way. Um, oh, sorry, I can see that your thing's being held for review. So, uh, how do I... Sorry, I'm not um, really good at this, so I'm trying to... Why won't that let me show your message? Oh, there. Uh, sorry, just bear with me. There's more chats. Uh, do you have it? I'll just say dead. Uh, Kane, your, your uh, profile has now been up. Sorry, I had to work out how to do that. Okay, I have to... Go just comment the code on his newest video. I'll look at it. Uh, UI meant not UA. Why you play? Hi, Deepak. Um, how are you? Why do I play Clash of Clans? <laughs> I guess because um, we're addicted to it. So I've been playing it for a number of years. And I think once you uh, put so much time into something... <laughs> I'll get to the other comments in a moment. When you put so much time into something, uh, you tend to not want to let it go. And the other thing, uh, geez, Supercell should pay me for this because I'm about to give them a good plug. Clash of Clans was one of the, the uh, first games that I came across that was really quite a... It's a community game as well. Like, you'll find that uh, if you have... A clan that's been around for a while or you meet a lot of people in global or in our case we've got the youtube channel as well you end up actually meeting people all over the world and i've met some really good people some really 
kind-hearted and and just generous and just nice people to to get to know uh even through the the youtube and clash of clans i've managed to speak uh to a, a person from america that you know i don't know who this person is but i like him he's, he's a great guy i tried to say hello to him today but i guess he's not around at the moment uh oh, okay so here we go again Where's, where are you sweepers one over there and one over there this is good he's got his sweepers in very bad positions so that's good for me so here we go again uh, uh, again I'm sorry you're seeing the similar style attacks but there's just uh, not a lot I can do about it at the moment given what uh, what I'm stuck with so sorry if I'm going quiet again Go, take out that eagle artillery. Do it, do it now. Take it out. Oh, I'm going to struggle with the eagle artillery again. No, it did it. Well done. All right, that makes things a lot easier. So again, just waiting on the heroes at this point. Things are looking reasonably good. Uh, I'll get to the chats in a moment, guys. Sorry, I'm just uh, concentrating on the game right now. Almost there. And if you can see, I kind of pressed that Queen special ability early. Uh, again, we've got a tutorial video on that as to why. Uh, and same with the King. You want to try and get those things back to full health as soon as you can. waiting for that to end and then I'll get back to the chats oh someone's watching me on this one I wonder who that was and oh no there's still something going I've got a tiny uh, what are they called the little pups from the lava hound they're still going strong all right so let's have a look not you ain't clear I'd love to give you some choco bickies uh, cane but which state are you in? Is it New South Wales or Queensland? I'm assuming it's one of those two, seeing as the, you're following that rubbishy uh, football. Uh, Say so Radiant. Hi, Radiant. I don't think I've said hello to you before. Uh, can Clash of Clans players be bulk? Um, I don't know what bulk is, Radiant Scars, so if you want to tell me that. Um, I'll be happy to respond to that. I just don't know what it is. And buy again, Kane, but oh, black. Yeah, why not? Uh, Clash of Clans players can be uh, all. If you're talking about race, I, oh, sorry, I was doing that. If you're talking about like what their ethnic background is, um, I've met uh, even in our own clan, we've got players from all over the world. Uh, it's an international clan, so um, yeah, they can be anyone, pretty much. Not sure why you'd ask that. Um, yeah, I wasn't sure if he was trying to be a, a little bit racist or not. It didn't, I sort of didn't want to take it that way. Hopefully it just means, you know, can they? Yeah, they can. End of question. Um... Oh, sorry, Kane. I'm confusing you with um, Macca. Sorry, that's right. You're from the States. He's from Australia. Well, it's going to be even harder to get you, Choco Biggies. And it looks like I'm up for a raid again, but what did I say I was going to do? Check. Yeah, you can see that the... Um, where is it? There's the Grand Warden. It's upgrading, and I was going to show the attacks. So you can see I haven't lost one yet. Um, and that's just because you get good at using the troops you know how to use. All right, so back into it. Um, oh, <laughs> well, Kane, I'm very gullible. I, I uh, tend to believe what anyone says at first until they prove me wrong. So if you end up uh, saying something and then I find out that uh, that's wrong, then I'm not going to believe you. Uh, clan clash with Kevin clan give I guess you're saying do you want me to or you want me to give you the clan probably not going to happen 
Um, you'd have to be in the clan first and then be there for a long time and prove that you can actually be a good leader. And then once you can do that, yeah, I'm happy to give over the leadership. I've actually done it a few times before. Uh, oh, my soundtrack has ended. So this stream has uh, gone for the length of the soundtrack already. And sorry, it's pretty much the same music all the time because I've got to do the copyright free stuff. Uh, but so far, so good. We're still going strong with this one. So get rid of that. Go back to here. So if you weren't here at the start, then this should all be new music to you. And sorry again for the, the clouds, but it's actually not too bad at the moment. In your clan, how is Elder and Coan? So it's those same simple rules um, that if you're showing that you're a good donator, which means you're donating more troops than you're actually taking, that will certainly get you um, promoted. If you're doing the wars and you're fighting twice and you're doing the clan games, that's also going to get you um, recognised for promotion. But really, the, yeah, thank you, Kane. I've, I actually put in a fair bit of work uh, trying to get the background music that people might like. Uh, we're always striving to, to make the videos entertaining. So the music you're actually listening to, we've used in every other previous video. And we just put a uh, compilation there. Hi, Tristan. I don't think I've said a hello to you before. How are you? Uh, now, like everyone else that has said can they join the clan? We have no problem accepting new members. Uh, the problem that you're going to find is that we're usually full. So the, the guys in our clan are pretty loyal and you have to basically wait for someone to be booted out for doing uh, something wrong. Uh, the clan name is A1 Clan. Uh, after this this raid, you can have a look. I'll show you if you wanted to have a look at anything in there. Oh, did you really? Yeah, I, I do get around in global quite a bit. Uh, generally just advertising. Farid. Yeah, I remember Farid. I guess that was you. So thank you for, for actually stopping by as well. We, we actually appreciate that. Um, because uh, the global is sort of the, the way that we advertise for the channel or if we do have a space in the clan, then it's for that as well. So you can either, and again, I'm repeating myself just because I mentioned it earlier in the stream, but um, what I'll do is at the end of the clan games, I'll have a look at the list and see uh, who's being active or who isn't. If they're not in a... A league if they haven't been donating troops and they didn't do clan games well chances are I'm gonna boot someone at the end of the the clan games so it will make a space available just make sure that you do follow the rules that's the only thing that we we ask that um, it, you're only gonna get booted for you know three or four reasons basically if you don't have a good donation ratio then you know you'll probably get booted if you don't fight twice in war when you've opted in, you'd get booted. Uh, or if you're completely inactive, well, you'll be booted for that. Or if you're rude or something like... But that's basically it. They're the only reasons we do it. So um, sometimes I don't have control over that either because uh, there's a lot of co's. Uh, they've earned it all. Like, I can remember a few times people giving me a bit of rubbish for the number of... Uh, promotions that we've got in our clan but what they don't realize is everyone's earned it uh, what should I upgrade first heal rage gobs or healer so the first thing I'll say Tristan is upgrade what you use the most so if you use um, heal the heal spell more than the rage spell then upgrade the heal spell first if you use the rage more than upgrade the rage spell first uh, if you're not doing either, then I'd say Rage over Heal because uh, it is a bit more useful for war attacks and things like that. And again, if it's the same with your um, troops, I would say Healer over Goblins. Um, I've never used Goblins in the game. I think maybe one raid once. Uh, I think they're personally kind of useless. Uh, but don't, don't, you know, I've seen plenty of other people use them with great effect, but... It's just me personally, I, I don't think that uh, they do too much. 
So uh, if it was me, yeah, I'd do Rage and Healer. Uh, but you always want to try and upgrade the stuff that you actually use the most. So hopefully that one will help. Uh, yeah, it was great chatting with you again as well, Kane. Uh, if you can really be bothered doing the research, try and find a live stream on AFL. Our grand final is today. Uh, what if I use one Rage, one Hill and three Earthquake? Uh, then again, I'd say uh, do the Rage first. Yeah, do the Rage first because that's... Um, sorry, Tristan, what Town Hall are you? Because uh, that'll help influence the decision as well. And also, while you're, you're typing that, uh, what troops do you tend to use? Because... Um, Depending on the troops, you may use, uh, say you're a Town Hall 8, so yeah, I'd say Rage spell. Uh, just because Rage is very good to use with dragons uh, when you're doing an attack or particularly in war. Um, heal spells, they're good for other troops, like if you're using hogs or something like that, then heal spells are good for hogs. But based on what you've told me so far, I'd do Rage first. Uh, and the healer for the troops. Yeah, so hopefully that would help. I'd be interested to know how you go with that. Um, if you look at some of the other videos that we've posted, you might actually see um, people using those type of troops and seeing how they're being used with uh, the combination of spells as well. Uh, one of those uh, good videos that does do that is looking at the funneling one. Just because it does use, uh, you'll see a number of different people with a number of different attacks and they are using different combinations. Uh, so you use 12 Elk, 1 Golem, 12 Wiz and 5 Hogs. Alright, I've never, so again this is a, an attack that I've, I've seen other people use but I myself have never used it. Um, it would... Yeah. See, the, with that combination, heal spells actually would be good, but um, I'd still recommend if you're using both, just go for the rage first and then the heal one after that. Yeah. But that looks like a good combination too. So uh, I'd be very curious to know how you go with that. So yeah, stay in touch via the YouTube and uh, let me know how, how it worked out. I'd be very curious to see. Uh, again, sorry for the, the clouds. This is just what life is like when you're in the, the legends. It takes quite some time. All right. Uh, do you use that, Tristan, do you also use that same attack when you do war attacks or do you use a different combination of troops? Or I guess for that matter, do you not do war attacks? I'm always sort of learning stuff from, I never lose an attack using my attack, it works pretty well. Oh, that's good, Tristan, because that's exactly what I've been saying quite a bit in this stream, that if you get very good at a, a particular combination, that helps you a lot. Uh, I would also recommend get good at more than one type of combination. So at the moment, you see, well, if you ever see me get out of the clouds, uh, this is what I'd call the, the air troop combination that I use. Um, yeah, good, good. Mix it up. It's good to mix it up. I'm actually, uh, what should I say? I'm being a bit of a hypocrite because I don't do it often enough. I should use more different combinations of troops, but to be honest, I get a bit lazy with the game. I've been doing it for so long. I just use what I can, uh, what I know how to use. Alright, so for this one, you might just do a dead on straight attack. Looks like not a bad way to go. Oh, geez, I might not have waited for all of the troops to train it. Looks like that's not good. I didn't go, didn't go in with a full set of troops. Or spells. No, that's not good. Oh, no. <laughs> I didn't have all the spells, all the troops. This might be a bit difficult. I might struggle at this point. No. Oh, I didn't want this to happen. Still looking all right at the moment, but 
Oh no, it should be okay. I think it'll be okay. As long as those heroes don't die too quickly like that one just did. Oh, I dare say this has probably messed up my troop lineup as well. But I have to say, it's probably not going to look so good uh, when I go to train more troops. We'll see what happens. Alright, so just basically waiting for the troops to die at that point. Uh, I use the same in war and regular. Yeah, yeah, I tend to... Well, actually, no, I'll use a different troop combination for, for wars than what I'm using right now, but... Yeah, I could have uh, Tristan. To be honest, I'm not... When I'm streaming, I tend not to pay too much attention uh, to what I'm doing. Uh, I would say, though, that when it comes to using the the special powers of the heroes, we've, we've already got a video on that that you might want to check out. That my personal belief is that you want to try and max out the hero's health. So when the health starts going down, you do want to try and get it back to full health as much as you can. So when the the, the king starts to change colour a bit, uh, that's when I hang on. I've, that's when I tend to press it. So just bear with me because I've really messed up this queue somehow. I'm not too sure what's what I've done. Uh, just bear with me. I've only got six. Uh, so that should be okay. Sorry, I'm talking to myself at the moment. So if you put that there and that there and that over there. Yeah, that's correct. Okay, that should be okay. Oh, I've messed up the... Jeez, I've messed everything up. Uh, let's, no, I'm going to get rid of that. That's better. Okay, I think all of that's all right. Now, just for you, you guys, uh, let's have a look. Yeah, all right, I'll waste one more boost. As you can see, it's a, a bit of a waste of a boost here. I can't really uh, store any more resources. And while we're doing that, I might as well just keep going with the clan challenge. So, it's doing this one as well. I'll get to you in a moment, Tristan. I'm just uh, concentrating on the game for a moment. So this is what I'd basically call a uh, lazy, lazy attack when it comes to the builder base. Alright, get that town hall guys, do it. Come on you packers, do it. Oh, this doesn't look like it's going to be that good of an attack either. Might be struggling a little bit there. Try and get the two stars. This is kind of critical for this one. Uh, almost there. Oh, yes. Second star, which is good. All right. Now, Tristan, where are we? I'm good with loons on my... Yeah, that's good. It's good that you're using a uh, different combination as well as learning how to use air. That That's a good thing to do. Here we go. I've still got a few of those to go. Uh, he still did good for you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I was a bit lucky with that one. I think he might have had a fairly weak base to uh, not have the full complement of troops and spells. Uh, usually if I don't have my fourth er earthquake, I get mad because I can't make my funnel as easy. Well, that that's the thing, Tristan. You actually need four earthquake spells. For them to take out the walls, you need four earthquakes. So there's no point training three. They're not going to quite take out the walls. Um, and everyone's different. Some people love the, the earthquakes. Some people love the jump spells. Uh, again, for me personally, I don't use either. I just use the wall breakers to do it. 
Um, I'm not very good with earthquake or, or jump spells uh, just because I don't practice with them enough. So uh, that's one there to, to be aware of. But yeah, you should always use four earthquake if you're going to use them. Uh, anything less than that tends, tends not to work. Uh, now, if you guys wanted to see anything on the base, let me know while I'm here and waiting for those troops to finish training. Where are we? Everything's still got a ways to go at the moment. And... Those, uh, for anyone that can take those siege machines but can't train them themselves, they're very expensive. Uh, oh, I understand. You requested as the, the fourth one. Yeah, that's not a bad way to go as well. That's actually good. Um, no. So since the everything was maxed, obviously, before the last update, but um, since the last update, they actually... Pretty much everything on the base had to be upgraded. Now, when it comes to the walls, so this might be new for you, I can't actually upgrade any more walls at the moment. So they, they restrict you at the top level. Um, the next update, they'll, if it's the same as what they were doing before, um, if it's the same as what they were doing before, they'll let me do 25 at a time. Uh, troops still got a long way to go on that. It takes so long to upgrade stuff. Like everything takes two weeks or something like that. If I pick that, so, you know, it takes two weeks to, to upgrade pretty much everything. So it does take a, a long time. And then uh, even with the defences, uh, I've still got quite a way to go on that. There's a few things that are maxed, but still a lot to go. So. Archer tower there, you can see cannon there has got to be upgraded. All of the air defense has to be upgraded. Uh, some of the inferno towers, and then after I oh, am the mortars, and then after that it'll be it'll be uh, full. But yeah, it does. I don't uh, spend money on the game, um, so I have used uh, what are they called gift cards by filling out online surveys. So. I've used a couple of gift cards over the years, but um, no, once once you max everything, it, it does kind of get a little bit boring. So you can see from the base there, like my loot's maxed already. I can't spend it at the moment. There's just no heroes. Uh, sorry, no, no um, builders available. And it's the same again with the treasury. I, I can't really empty it. Well, I could, but there'd be no point. Um, hi Anshu Aga Wall, nice to meet you. How are you today? And hi also Indian Lunatic. Um, someone might have to play to me, uh, explain to me what PUBG is. I don't know what that is. I've seen it a lot. I've been a little bit too lazy to research. So yeah, you're not talking to someone that's particularly up to date with things. I'm not tech savvy. Um, called a bit of a techno tart and I'm not that up to date with games either so there's there's a few games that I like uh, give the clan code um, how do I do that I don't know how to <laughs> this geez, I can't believe I've been playing for years I don't know how it is but the the clan itself is called a1 clan so if you have a look there you can see basically it's a le level 11. I was like Fort. Oh, I like shoot 'em up games. PUBG, except for Fortnite. I don't understand why people love that so much. It doesn't look that good to me. Um, take your take. Take my name. As in Anshu Agarwal. Do you mean take your name? Uh, I'll have to look into this PUBG guys, because uh, I love the shoot 'em up games. They're quite enjoyable. I've only got uh, Call of Duty myself and we did want to do a um, a stream on it one day. Uh, it's an older one though because we've got the Call of Duty 4 but it doesn't let us do the split screen multiplayer which was really annoying. We, we enjoy doing that uh, but the older one that's um, 
I think Call of Duty Black Ops or something allows us to do it. So I was actually hoping to do it today, but uh, Stink Pants is not here. She's working today, so unfortunately we couldn't get that organised. Um, is the PUBG game free or you have to buy it? And also, is it uh, is it a PS4 game or is it a, a um, iPhone game or what? Uh, anything that you can teach me, I'm always happy to learn. And uh, do you require Max Clan games? Uh, no, you can get 500 points. Look, I'll show you the. Oh, hang on. Sorry, I got a raid again. Uh, stick around, tri uh, stick around, and shoe. Oh no, stick around, Tristan and Anshu, but Tristan and I'll show you the clan games in a moment. Oh, it's mobile and it's free. I'll have to download that. PUBG. All right, I'll do that after the stream. Um, I suppose we probably should do more variation on the, the gaming, but we don't do a lot of gaming is the, the thing. Like, we're, we're not heavy uh, gamers. We do enjoy what we play but just don't want to get addicted to too much. <laughs> We're already addicted to uh, Clash of Clans, which seems to take up a bit of time. Um, so no, I'll show you the, the clan games after this uh, raid, Tristan, so you can have a look. Because the reality is uh, we do get the max rewards pretty much always. Uh, I think we've only missed it maybe once. And if you have a look at the list, there's not that many people that actually max it out. Now, thankfully, we do have uh, a certain number of players that you can rely on that will max out every game. So it's like, oh, you've got the guaranteed 4,000 points or whatever it is from X number of players. So uh, when it's the 50,000 point one, if you have 10 players that max it 4,000 points, you've already got 40,000 points just with 10 players alone. So the rest of them don't have to, to really pick up the, the um, workload. But thankfully in our clan, it looks like if, if we're a little bit behind uh, being on target in terms of the amount of time left, uh, what I've noticed is people do tend to pick up the slack. So they'll help out a little bit more uh, if they can. But uh, just as long as you contribute, that's generally all we care about. Just contribute and it's good. Uh, so with the, the giveaways, I was thinking about doing it. The, the channel's still very small at the moment, so it's probably not worthwhile doing it just yet. And yeah, I was thinking of doing gift cards, but I'm also a bit of a scumbag, which means... <laughs> Number one for me to get the gift cards, I've got to do those online surveys that I was talking about, and I haven't done that for a long time, so that'd be the first thing. Now, the second one is someone did actually recommend to me to not do them, and he gave his reasons why, and I actually understand why he was saying that, and I don't disagree with that. Now, um... So it's not something that's going to be done in the near future just because the channel's still tiny. Like we've got a very small channel at the moment. So uh, for the amount of time and effort that we, we need to organise that, we do want it to grow a little bit more. Um, you know, the, the goal for me personally was once we get to a thousand subs or more, then we'll start taking things a fair bit more seriously. Uh, for the moment, it's just a bit of fun to try and help people. And just excuse me, uh, where are we? So that's where that one is. All right, hopefully this one will be okay as well. We'll see how it goes. Again, sorry if I go a little bit quiet while I'm concentrating. But hopefully this one will be okay. All right. That Grand Warden would be kind of helpful at the moment, but it looks like this guy's got a number of defences down it as well, so that should make this a fair bit easier. That's what I'm hoping anyway. Get in there and kill that Town Hall if you can. That's the aim. Good stuff. Oh, that pesky air defence. You can see how much of a trouble it causes the, the air defence when it activates. 
and it looks like my heroes are stuck in the corner there so we'll use the ball breakers this time to get them moving again oh we might get lucky you might end up seeing the the first one that's uh, three star we'll see how it goes but with this one um, it was a it was a base that did look like it uh, didn't have strong defenses so I can't really take too much credit for it there's a lot of defenses that were down but we'll see how it goes it's gonna be close Oh, looks like we could do it. As long as that queen gets in there and starts taking out some stuff. Yeah, not too many defences left. We'll be celebrating. Queen still hasn't used her special power. And last one. Alright, I'll use it now. Yes. Shows that I'm not completely useless. Um... Oh, well, thank you, uh, Tristan. It was a pleasure talking to you. Uh, very entertaining as well. Uh, thank you for actually saying stuff because it makes it hard to do a stream if no one's uh, talking to me. I don't, don't really know what to say if I'm talking to myself. So appreciate that. It'll be good to, to see you again, Tristan. You take care now. So I'm just lining up the troops. So any of you other uh, people that are in the, the stream at the moment, if you want to say hi or you've got any questions, uh, don't hesitate. I'm pretty friendly. I'm not going to bite. Um, and in the meantime, just making sure all of that's good. How long have we got on the troops? Enough time to do another builder aid, it looks like. Oh, geez, that guy slaughtered me. What do we got here? So don't follow what I do when it comes to builder base stuff because I'm extraordinarily lazy when it comes to the, the builder base. I don't like putting in too much effort into it. All right, now which way are you gonna go? The, the thing I gotta look out for is that uh, big cannon because that does a lot of damage to the, the hero. You want it pointing towards the uh, peckers rather than the hero. And also that, um, I forget what it's called, that thing that slams down. That does a lot of damage as well. Now, yes, that's what we want. Let's have a look here. Hopefully we'll take out the town hall. It's going to be close. Better take out the town hall. Do it. Take out the... No! Go back! No, you want to go to the town? Oh, you stupid hero and stupid Becca. The town hall was there for the taking. Just wouldn't do it. No, we'll have to wait and see how that went. So I almost finished that uh, clan games challenge there, it looks like. One more to go. I dare say that guy destroyed me, though. Oh no, we won that one. He must have had a bad attack. Well, not a not a good one, I should say. All right. So Hero's just got a little bit more to train. We'll see what happens here. So at the moment, yes, I'm talking to myself. So unless I'm missing some some chats there, doesn't look like I am. All right. So. Uh... What else can I say? This is where I struggle a bit with the, the live stream. Talk to me or I just end up talking to myself and probably sounding like a bit of an idiot. Uh, the guys are doing quite well. Looks like we're halfway there with the clan games and five days to go. So things are looking pretty good at the moment. We should get the uh, next tier soon. And again, just waiting on that last clan trope. I'm also surprised this uh, stream hasn't cut out yet. Normally it just dies at some certain point. So for the couple of you that are left, uh, if it does cut out at some point, my apologies, it's not me doing it. It's something else, whatever that something is. All right. So again, just waiting for the troops to finish training and we'll go for one or two more raids 
Still, actually, I've still got quite a bit left on the boost there. Might end up taking quite some time to do that. Treasury's starting to get pretty full. Clan's full, everyone's been donated to, there's not a lot going on. Might as well do a bit of free advertising while I'm at it. And what else can I show you guys? I guess because I keep looking at my own base, I really don't know uh, what is entertaining to, to look at when you're looking at someone else's base. And hopefully that's uh, good enough for you. I also normally want to put, uh, not that one, normally I want to put uh, that as the default one to, to look at, but uh, whenever you get new things, uh, it's you have to clear them before you can actually use that base and I don't have any builders to clear so I might leave it there for the moment and just wait and see uh, where are the heroes where are they oh no it's not going to let me see it there. no I can't leave it there alright we're almost ready for another attack and I might have to uh, end this stream soon, I guess. It's been going for a fair bit longer than I thought it would. Alright, so that's that one. And at this point, I may end up going a little bit quiet, seeing as I have been talking to myself for quite some time. Uh, we've only got one person in here at the moment that's not even saying hi. So, whoever you are, Mr. Anonymous, uh, hello, nice to have met you. Uh, All right, so I'm just checking a couple of things while I'm doing this. There. Uh, oh, you want me to visit your base? Actually, is that is that what you're saying? Because uh, I will do that after this uh, raid, if you like. I've noticed there's a, a few people that stream that do that specifically. They say they'll check your base and and have a look. Um, yeah, I will do. I'll just wait for this. Uh, this search to be over and then I'll check your base for you. Is there anything particular that you wanted me to look at or is it just um, just a general visit? Because I'm happy to provide advice if that's what you're after. Uh, otherwise we will uh, showcase your base. You also, just bear in mind as well actually, um, I don't do it very often so you might have to help me uh, work out how to actually visit your base. I think I've only ever tried it once before, um, so we'll see how that goes. But uh, after this raid, and apologies for life in the clouds, but this is basically what it's like when you're, you're in the Legends League. It takes uh, today or this morning for me, it hasn't been too bad. It, it uh, hasn't taken as long as it often does. I don't know if you guys have ever seen that um, once you've been in the clouds for half an hour or more, you actually get a message saying, oh, we can't find a base for you. Thankfully, that hasn't happened today, but um, the worst I've had is to get three of those messages in a row and then I gave up, which means that, you know, I was sitting there looking at the screen you're looking at for about an hour and a half uh, without even getting a, a base to look at, so... I suppose the one good thing is um, it's forced me to attack the very first base that I see. So I don't bother skipping bases now. It's just it takes too long. So you just end up sitting there and just waiting for the first base to come along, someone that you can actually attack. So hopefully that'll happen soon. And then straight after that, I'll check your base for you, actually. So I appreciate your patience there. Hopefully it'll happen soon. 
Uh, but in the meantime, there's not actually a lot I can do there. So leave the global chat on for you for something to look at. Uh, hopefully those people don't mind. So yeah, it looks like people come and go in clans all the time. They're always saying that in uh, the chat. Thankfully, we've got uh, people that generally don't want to leave. Once they're in, they want to stay there. All right. So again, just uh, waiting. I might as well do a little complaint here just because I've got nothing else to do. And you'll see legends, uh, people do this every now and again. Just because it takes so long. This is crazy. So as I said, not too bad. You can see a lot worse than this. We'll see if anyone responds to that. Just while I'm waiting for that, uh, actually, what uh, base level are you? Yeah, 9, 10 town hall? What level town hall are you? <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Uh, so, that shouldn't have, uh, <laughs> if you're watching this and you know who I'm talking about, uh, with the, the uh, messages, just be aware they actually pop up on the, the live stream. And why don't you say hello to me? I was going to call you after, after this stream ends. It's actually been going for a lot longer than normal it tends to cut out after an hour but so far it's it's just um being good keeps going so i was gonna see i assume you're one of the people that are actually in the chat and you know who i'm talking to uh, i was gonna see what you're doing today is uh the first person that joined was from australia and i'm like oh you're watching the grand final today and he said no it's tomorrow uh, it turns out he's an NRL fan, doesn't even understand AFL. So I said to him, well, you're not Australian then, are you? No, I didn't say that. So I was going to see if you wanted to watch the game today. The thing is, there's not too much else is going on and Stink Pants has gone to work, so she's not here at the moment. Oh, you did it again. I've got to keep, mate, as long as you don't mind that that's popping up in the live stream, I am trying to get rid of it as soon as possible. <laughs> Uh, so we'll say hi in the chat there. Don't send me a message. Otherwise, you're just going to keep seeing that pop up. And uh, this, just so that you're aware, uh, young fella, this is what it's like when, um, when you're in the sort of top league and waiting to do an attack. The game hasn't sorted itself out yet, so... It's looking for, for someone for me for me to attack, and it's been doing it for a few minutes already. So you're probably wondering, why do I play this game when it's like that? It takes so long to do. But we'll get there sooner or later. It hasn't been too bad today. So yeah, help me out, my friend. Talk to me. It's weird talking to myself. I am going to check Akshay's base uh, once this stops searching for, for someone, but in the interim, I'm still just talking to myself. <laughs> I also want to know how loud can I have that music, because I like having it up a little bit. Just to keep you guys entertained, rather than having no sound whatsoever. Oh, this cloud search is taking ages. Might as well advertise. Oh, finally. All right, here we go. Jeez, he's got a very rushed base. That's a badly rushed base. Uh, tip for anyone watching, don't do this, it's not worth it. This this uh, person's going to take a long time to try and recover where he's at and he may or may not struggle getting into a clan. 
because we certainly wouldn't accept a base like this. This one's super weak. Okay, take out the town hall. Do it. Take it out. Oop. Uh, sorry, uh, Mr. Muzz, I'll have to check that message later. I think you said, I'm not sure if you said it's loud enough or too loud. One of the two. Alright. So this way, yeah, take out that town hall, do it! Take it out! I was actually aping for a three star on this base. Yes! Alright, that's good. Yeah, heroes go. Oh no, I shouldn't have done that. I thought he was. No, oh, I thought he was actually going to go there, but hopefully, oh no, that's okay. Hopefully one of them will go there. <coughs> All right. So I'm almost there, actually, just waiting for these heroes to do their thing, and then I'll check your base. As I said, you might have to show me how, because I don't really do that very often. Looks like the queen already needs a bit of special power activated. Got the king to go, almost there. Well, what do you reckon? Bets anyone, is this going to be a three star or not? I think we might struggle here. Oh no, that's a, is that a single inferno? Yeah, that's a single inferno. No, that's not good. That's gonna kill the king quick. Nah, we're not gonna get three stars on this one. I suppose if I used the clan troops, it would have been three stars, but no need just be a waste of resources at the moment. Is that it? They're all dead? Looks like they're all dead. Alright, so that's that one. Just, uh, just bear with me, uh, bear with me actually, I'm just training troops first. there. Alright, that's looking good. Uh, now I'm wasting this boost just for you, actually, so I hope you can appreciate it, because I should be raiding straight away. Now, how do I do this? I go to clan... Oh, search players. Okay, that's how you do it. Now, what is it? Uh, P nine L G Q two J L Y. I think that's right. Oh yeah, Akshay Banner. That's you. You got a pretty decent profile there for a, a Town Hall 8. Nicely done. Yeah, that's a solid, uh, that's quite a solid profile. Alright. Oh, from memory, actually, that looks like a very strong Town Hall 8. I'm impressed with that. I don't think my Town Hall, in fact, I know my Town Hall 8 wasn't that strong. Uh, yeah, when it came to the walls, you've got much stronger walls than I ever had. Well done. That's good. Cute little builder base there as well. Awesome job. So there you go. There's Akshay's base. It's a good design as well. You've done well. Nice one. All right. So we're back to the... the uh, well, actually, oh, I should just make sure that I've got full everything. Just bear with me. Yep, full everything. So I'm glad you asked me to check your base there actually. I always like seeing smaller bases that are, are strong. It means that you haven't rushed and you've put in a fair bit of effort to get where you are. I assume that your defences are pretty good. Like You probably win a lot of defences it looks like. 
I'm sure if I was a town hall aide, I'd struggle to attack that base. All right, so again, just waiting, waiting, waiting. doing more advertising at the moment just because there's nothing else to do so I might as well do this let's see if that actually works we'll see if we can get anyone to come in just from that advertising <laughs> Curious to see if that works. Uh, so, might listen to a bit of music seeing as no one's saying hello. And yeah, I might have to stop the, the live stream myself. As soon as the uh, second boost is over, I'll, I'll uh, stop the live stream because really I'm just uh, playing it for the sake of playing it at the moment. I'm not really getting in anything out of these raids until one of the builders becomes available. It's just going to keep giving me or not giving me um, loot, I should say. Well, there was an update for one of the apps that's being used. Maybe that uh, helped with uh, not cutting out on the stream because this is definitely the longest one that we've had so far. There's a little bit of help for someone that's in uh, global just for the heck of it, whether they listen to me or not. So there's a little tip for you as well that if you're advertising your clan in uh, global, you're better off being in an actual league because it just shows that you're active. Uh, yeah, Tristan, I can do that as well. You're back, it looks like. So I just showed uh, Akshay's base. I'll have a look at yours uh, once this search is over as well. It took a little bit of time to, to get the last search done, but as soon as it is, we'll have a look. And because you, uh, I'm getting more requests to look at people's bases, I've actually think I know how to do it properly now, so it shouldn't take as, lo as long next time. It's uh, with me, learning's all about repetition. The more I do it, the easier it becomes. So I'll be curious to see what your base looks like though. Apologies, it's beyond my control when it comes to... Uh... Oh, it cut out. Did it cut out? Oh, can uh, one of you let uh, just type something to let me know if the stream's still there because I got a message saying that it actually stopped but then it started again so I don't know if it's still working or not and the other thing is the last time that happened i didn't realize that people were actually sending chats because i couldn't see them oh yeah it's still going okay that's good yeah I, I don't know how to apologize to everyone in the the previous stream that i did where they're actually trying to talk to me and i couldn't see the messages 
So this one uh, looks to be a very healthy stream. It's about to hit the two hour mark. Can't believe I've been sitting here for that long. Uh, but we will just give it till the end of the uh, the second boost because I might stop playing for a bit and I might end up uh, going to a mate's place today that I happened to say hello to, to me during this stream although not in the chat for all I know he's still there he's not saying hello No, not yet. So, because I, I'm still uh, new to streaming and even YouTube and learning the technologies and things, um, it's a bit slow going. And plus, it's something that's very, um, how do I put it? Like, not unique to me, but it's a different sort of, if I can call it a skill set. I didn't realise that you, you kind of need uh, some skills to have an entertaining stream because it's such a one-way thing. I'm sitting here doing all of the talking and relying on you guys on the chat to, you know, write comments and whatever so that I can actually respond to it. Um, so I'm still sort of developing that skill. Now, uh, the other thing, just so that I've got something to talk about is... Um, I'm not sure if it's the same for everyone, but uh, we've got obviously internet at home and it's uh, wireless that we would connect through the phones to play the game. Well, what we found was the, the home wireless isn't actually very good for it. And after doing a bit of research, a lot of people were saying that using Wi-Fi at home is not good for streaming. So the problem we had was... Um, with my phone plan, it's got a very small data plan attached to it. It's not a, a great plan. Uh, now, I recently fixed that because it's attached to a few other phone plans and I changed the other ones so that we could get more data. So I'm actually using the data on the phone for this, but it chews through a lot. I wouldn't be surprised if this stream has gone through six gig already, maybe more. And that's a lot for a mobile phone uh, data plan. So we do want to stream more, um, but I also want to get good at it. Like I don't want to put up rubbishy streams that are really boring. And to be honest, I think the last two streams that I put up weren't good. Um, they, I don't think they were very entertaining. Um, I was struggling to to talk to people a little bit and certainly the the previous one as I said I couldn't even see the chat so I was I should have taken it down to be honest I'm not not very proud of either of those I think this one's gone a bit better just because a lot more people have said hello and they've been a lot more interactive in their chats because uh, I think that's probably what helps with the streaming now, the last thing I'll say on that, Tristan, is I was shocked that the very first stream that we did, even now, is just picking up uh, way more views than any other video that we've uploaded. And I don't know why. I don't think it was particularly good. In fact, um, I had the gameplay on for almost all of the... Uh, sorry, the, the game sounds and music on for most of the stream. And people were telling me, like, turn it down, and I didn't know how. I thought I, I couldn't hear it on my end, so it was like, oh, I thought I already turned it down. Uh, but we fixed that, as you can see with this one, and replaced the, the gameplay sounds with a soundtrack to, to make it a little bit more um, engaging. So, yeah, I mean, I'd love to... the Oh, you've got to go. Well, I haven't visited your base yet. Sorry for that. I'll still do it if you want, Tristan, uh, even though you're not there, uh, just so that you can actually have your base as part of the, the live stream. I'm happy to do that for you. But yeah, just apologies for the, the time in the clouds. There's not a lot I can do about that. Yeah, no worries. I'll, I'll uh, look at your base after this one. So you can always check. Um, 
you know, have a look after the two hour mark on the stream. Hopefully it won't be too much longer for the, the um, clouds, but it is certainly taking its sweet time at the moment. Yeah. Oh yeah, it, it takes ages. It can be quite, I'm surprised that they haven't worked a bit harder on the algorithms that they use. Because every time they say, oh, we're going to improve it, it does for a little bit. So you end up being able to do fairly quick raids. And then within a few days or a day or two, it uh, just slows down again. Uh, so then I'll check tomorrow. Um, no, you don't really need to, to do anything. I'll just um, I'll use that uh, profile... Um, ID to check your base but if you are oh, to fix it all right so I'll have a look and um, leave a comment in the stream and then you can check where that is so I'm sorry I, I can't tell you obviously now when that's going to be until this uh, stupid search is over but um, I'll do my best so uh, fair warning though I don't think I'm particularly good at designing bases um, I'm also pretty lazy at it. No worries, so it's great talking to you, Tristan. You actually, um, even though you've been just typing and I've been talking, you sound like a great person and always happy to have a chat to someone like you. So, and hopefully we'll see you again. Uh, the other thing is, yeah, I do tend to get to know the names as well. So even some people that have visited the stream today I've uh, already recognised who they are just because they've been so supportive so yeah be happy to chat to you again when you're around and hopefully I'll do a stream like once a week or maybe a bit more often um, I'd prefer to have stink pants here as well so oh you never then what do you <laughs> you don't need my help <laughs> I think I need yours because uh, I tend to I think at our level, I could be wrong about this, but um, it's very easy to beat bases, so uh, I tend not to lose attacks, but by the same token, uh, I tend not to win defences. So uh, nearly every time, you know, my base will get beaten, but by the same token, I'll beat nearly every base. I think that's just what happens when you start getting really high up in the game. It gets a little bit uh, easier. So, and the confidence builds as well. So, no, but I might I might end up getting tips from you, Tristan. I'll check your base and see if uh, I can incorporate your design in any way. Uh, having said that, I'm also pretty lazy at uh, redoing the base. I'll do it every now and again, but it takes uh, some time. So, uh, it's usually when I can be bothered. It's usually when the war base starts to suffer a bit is when it's it's time for me to look at doing something new. Uh, but the other thing I'll say is those siege machines, they've changed the, the game entirely. They make it way too easy for people that use them. Um, I only use them in war or if I really need to in a normal raid. So uh, I don't, don't use them that often, but when they do it, it just makes everything so easy. It makes it so easy to get to the town hall and to destroy... Uh, things and if you're good at attacking then three starring as well um, yeah my base has been three starred quite a bit it's a bit embarrassing but I guess you've got to get used to it after a while so again sorry for everyone that's still in the stream and being patient here and just still sitting in the clouds for, for ages it, uh, it does get frustrating hopefully they'll do another update and fix it but I would have thought if if someone from Supercell ever can be bothered looking at a tiny channel like ours and they've stuck with it and you're one of the three people listening now, here's my suggestion. Now, I've got to make it clear I'm not an actuarist. Uh, the last time I did any sort of math study was back in year 12 or form 12 or whatever you happen to call it, the final year of high school. Uh, but I would have thought you could create an algorithm where... You just go, look, once it's past a certain number of minutes of searching, just keep going down the list and then offering less as a reward. So, you know, even if I'm attacking someone that's in the Champions League or something like that, 
give me a maximum of um, three po- uh, three trophies available, you know, one for each star, uh, and then no loot. I'd still be happy with that because then I don't have to sit here and wait for the, the clouds to finish. And I'm sure that, you know, how hard could it be to set it up set it up that way and then you won't have so many people just sitting in the clouds uh, like we do because it, it's frustrating and it doesn't make the the game that enjoyable and particularly for a stream like what are you going to do just sit there and watch the the clouds and you know have the see if anyone bothers typing anything in the the global chat i mean that's basically all i can do while i'm waiting for a raid and talking to you guys so again, if you've got any questions or you need any help, don't hesitate to uh, post your question. I'll try and help you as best I can. A number of people have done that already in the chat, and I think at least one of them um, was very happy with uh, the advice that was given. Uh, I'm also not going to say that I give the best advice. I'm not the greatest player in the world, uh, but have been playing for quite some time, so... We do pick up things as we go. And let's face it, I'm happy to learn from you guys as well. If you have any tips or tricks, put them in the chat. I'll be uh, sure to learn from those as well. So uh, it's all good. Uh, Once again, I'm kind of just talking to myself at the moment. There's not a lot else I can do here. So I might as well just do another complaint about how long I'm in the clouds. It's because it takes so long. You see a lot of people in Legends do silly things like this or actually typing and complaining about it, but it does take some time. Maybe I should learn how to do some of that artwork that I see in Global all the time, just to, to remain entertained somehow. Uh, and if anyone wants to tell me whether the music's too loud or too soft, don't be afraid to do that as well. Um, I'm trying to work out the perfect levels for being able to hear me in the stream as well as uh, hopefully enjoying the the soundtrack in the background while you're waiting for stuff to happen in the game. So, yeah, apologies, not a lot I can do uh, about what's going on at the moment. And I've still got to remember to check Tristan's base as well. Uh, If we ever get past the clouds saying come on and no one's really saying anything in our chat as well there's just not a lot going on uh this early in the morning or late at night for i guess for the americans it's probably a bit late now i don't know what time it is there it's probably after midnight and get there sooner or later all right uh so i'm actually while i'm waiting for this uh just bear with me I'm just gonna go to uh, should I say yeah I'm just gonna go to the bathroom I'll be back in a minute We're back, and we've got something to raid. But that's, or oh, his air sweep is going to be a bit of a problem on this one, it looks like. We'll see how we go. And again, sorry if I go a little bit quiet just while I'm concentrating. okay so far but we want to take out that eagle artillery and that air defense is air sweeper is creating some problems for me and see now why i actually look at that as the first thing to what are we going to do to avoid that air sweeper because that really caused 
uh, wreaked havoc when it came to trying to get to the town hall and so on but it looks like we'll be okay anyway yeah that's 50% that's all we're after just waiting for the troops to die at this point hopefully the queen will do its business looks like it's just going to be a one star for this one almost there Queen's special power. Normally, I'd be saying, "Hey, go get that uh, elixir," but at this point, it makes no difference. And that looks like about it. All right, so that's that one. Now, we'll have a look at Tristan's base once I train some troops. And again, it looks like uh, the heroes are ready to go with that boost, but that's all right. It's not like I'm actually uh, getting any loot out of this. Alright, now what did I do before? First thing... Where is he? That's his thing. Where did I go for that? Just clan, my profile... Uh, social... Search players... Tristan, I assume that's you, or Farid. Hmm, it's looking like another solid uh, profile. That's looking pretty good. Let's have a look at the base. Oh, that's a good design as well. Yeah, I'm impressed by that. Looks like you got a few upgrades, although I'm not, not too sure. I mean, it's been a long time since... It was a town all late, but that's looking pretty good. Um, I really couldn't suggest too much as a way of an improvement. Um, I can't see where your traps are, obviously, so that may make a difference. But um, no, that's a quite a unique design. Don't mind that one at all. And another cute little builder base. So, Farad, I really couldn't suggest too much other than, you know, make sure you up, upgrade all, all your defences uh, before you do the town hall. Um, looks like a good spread to me. I really can't suggest too much. Yeah, it's pretty good. So, well done to you. Kudos. All right, how long have we got to go? Yep, so this looks like it might be the last raid and then... Um, We'll finish the stream after this, uh, just because it has been quite some time. What am I doing? All right, so last attack for the day. Uh, actually, no, I'll do one builder one after that, and then after that, that'll be it. All right, so thank you, very loyal uh, one watcher remaining. Um, yeah, there's, there's not a lot to... Oh, jeez. There you go, the soundtrack finished twice. This is the longest stream ever. Get the uh, one up and running again. I very much doubt anyone's going to sit through the entire stream, so I figure if we keep playing the same music over and over again, it's not such a bad thing. So I'm just setting that up now, and if you, the one watcher at the moment, if you weren't here at the start, then this will be all new to you. Basically, it's everything that we've put in every other video, so we'll see how that one goes. Actually, what I might do just for the heck of it is just reset the game and hopefully that will uh, speed things up a bit. It's probably more superstition than anything else. I don't know if it actually works, but I do it every now and again just to uh, see what happens and sometimes it does feel like it makes things go a bit quicker 
So we'll see if that works. Let's do a bit of free advertising for ourselves there. Hopefully someone will come and say hello on this last raid. was faster. Now where are those pesky... There's one air sweeper. Where's the other one? What am I blind? Where's the other air sweeper? No, oh, I can't find it. I'm going to have to go in blind. It should be... People tend to put them in the opposite areas. No, I'm going to have to go blind. I can't find it. Hopefully it's not somewhere. Oh, there it is. Now I can see it. All right, that's not in a bad place. That's actually okay for us. Might as well drop some stuff there just to speed things along. Now go get that Eagle Artillery. That's what you're supposed to do, Looney Loons. Take it out. Good stuff. That's like the most important thing to do when it comes to these sort of uh, bases. And again, looking alright. Looks like we'll get the win. It's not going to be a particularly good attack, but we'll see how it goes. Alright, so the last person that's actually left in the stream, if you want to say hi or bye, don't hesitate, because um, I'll do a a quick builder raid after this and then just end the stream it's been a, a fairly lengthy one I appreciate your, your patience in sticking around though it does make a big difference it sort of keeps me motivated to keep going so thank you for that I do appreciate it all right oh we actually did get two stars out of that I wasn't even watching <laughs> that's not too bad So just waiting for the last troops to die there. Still going strong. Gee, if I use the uh, clan troops, there's probably a good chance of three-starring. Might still three-star without them if we can take out those last defences. Only the king's on its last legs. One dragon just died. We've only got the queen left. And uh, archer, it looks like. Or two archers. It's probably not going to be enough. Well, that's pretty close, though. Almost there. Oh, this is close. If you can just... No. Oh, yeah. If you can just take out that uh, Wizzy Tower, you might get 100% on this one. Just take out the Wizzy Tower Queen. You can do it. You've got two archers sitting there that are just attacking walls. But I have the feeling the Queen's got just enough health to do this. But are we going to run out of time? Nine seconds. Do it. Take it out, Queen. Go. Yes. All right, so that's not too bad. Jeez, that's another lot of heap of loot that's just being wasted. All right, we'll do the Builder Base just for the clan games. Uh, yeah, I might as well do it from there. So with this one, normally I'd try to avoid the uh, big cannon there, just because it's pretty destructive to the um, the hero. But having said that, it's probably the best place to drop stuff. So I'm going to have to do it. Fingers crossed we get a star out of this, because it's not looking too good at the moment. Alright, and we'll 
looks like I've got no chance of getting to that town hall. I'm just going to keep going around the outside. And we do want to try at least get a star out of this. Come on. Let's go. Yes, good on you, Pekka. Oh, now you're going for the town hall. Go for it. Maybe we might just pull it off. Maybe not. Looks like... Oh, we did. Awesome. Not sure that's enough for the win, though. We'll see how that goes. Yeah, it was enough for the win. Good. And the uh, event was completed as well, so we might as well try and pick another one. The problem I'm going to... Yeah, it's all for the... Uh, main base so I tend not to pick those just because of how long it takes in the clouds usually and that'll do. I've only got a few hundred points to go so that's good all right so to my final uh, watcher there thank you so much for your patience and support um, if I can get this to work I'll end the live stream now so uh, thank you and I hope you have a fantastic day, whoever it happens to be there. So enjoy, enjoy the rest of your day. All right, bye.